Hello, everyone, and welcome to the McDonald Team 7K Wealth Strategies presentation. I know there are other team leaders on the Zoom, and we're proud to have you here. Uh, if you're a guest on the evening Zoom presentation, congratulations to you, because the only way you're here, uh, here with us tonight is because someone thought enough of you to invite you to be a part of this awesome 7K presentation. So uh, to get this started, uh, purchasing precious metals, bullion coins, and other collectibles involves risk. We strongly encourage you to exercise due diligence and properly educate yourself prior to purchasing precious metals. The information presented in 7K's Wealth Strategies is not to be considered tax or financial advice. We encourage you to seek appropriate professional advice regarding the tax and financial implications of buying and owning or selling precious metals. The price and future value of precious metals is based on many factors, including but not limited to market and economic conditions. Past performances of precious metals is no guarantee of future performance or future value. So that being said, ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to introduce you to an awesome leader. I've known this gentleman for uh, almost 14 years now, and he is helping and continues to help thousands of people not just in the United States, but now in multiple countries. So ladies and gentlemen, it's my pleasure to introduce you to Mr. Howard Cannon. Uh, good evening. Uh, while I get a screen set up, we're going to uh, go to Ms. Karras for just a moment. She's gonna share with you just uh, a little bit uh, and uh, sort of share what uh, has been going on with her. Ms. Karras, are you there? Harris, you'll need to uh, unmute, please. Uh, good evening, everyone. Can you hear okay? Yeah, we can hear you fine. Just speak a little louder if you would. Thank you. Okay, great. My name is Karis Easley. And I'm just on the call to let you know how excited I am about the K. Uh, I joined a couple months ago with and Mary Bumpus. And I learned a lot uh, about the organization. And shortly after, I did go ahead and join. Uh, we all know what's going on in the market right now with the dollar value declining. And then there's so much inflation. Um, but I will say that joining this organization um, has helped me because of my financial goals. And with me uh, wanting to increase my nest egg, I just felt that learning about the coin. So the right way to go. So I also encourage anyone who's on the call as a visitor or a new uh, guest uh, to be sure and take this very seriously because it truly is worth it. Thanks so much, uh, Howard and Kevin. Thank you, Ms. Karras. We really appreciate that. Oh. Hang on just a second. Having a little screen problem. Apologize. I apologize for this, folks. We're 7K uh, medals. <clears throat> and first thing we'd like to ask is, do you feel like you're working harder for your money or that things just don't have ends meet today? Well, that's because of uh, higher cost. And it's really not that uh, what you're buying has, has uh, gone up in cost. It's the fact that uh, the money you're spending has gone down in value. It's called fiat currency. And our currency today is not backed by a, uh, uh, a precious metal. Uh, they print uh, money uh, as the government wants to, and uh, that makes their, your dollar uh, worth less because uh, uh, paper money with no backing uh, has the value that people are willing to uh, uh, assign it. And as there's more printed, uh, it's treated with less value. As of 2022, 40% of Americans say that they could not cover a $400 emergency expense. And I would bet that that has uh, gone up in 2023 with the uh, way that uh, our money is starting to have uh, less value. In uh, 1913, the Federal Reserve was formed and that's sort of America's bank. And uh, a dollar was at, in 1913 was, was actually worth a dollar. Uh, 
in uh, 1933, FDR by executive order made it illegal to uh, uh, have gold. And the reason he did that was because our dollars in that era actually had uh, printed on them that it could, they could be traded for whether they were a silver certificate or gold certificate for precious metal. And in 1933, they, they changed that and they called in all the gold from across the country, although not everybody uh, probably uh, uh, met the requirements for, for the law. They probably hid gold and silver. I guarantee there are people who did, but uh, uh, we uh, uh, vaulted all that gold and uh, made it where uh, you could not uh, request gold or silver for your dollars. And then uh, in 1944, uh, at the end of World War II, uh, the uh, U.S. dollar became the established uh, world reserve currency. We were the strongest uh, currency on the planet, and we became the currency that uh, uh, countries paid their debts between each other and things like uh, oil would be purchased with. And then in 71, Nixon closed the gold window. And what that means is, is that suddenly our dollars were not backed by gold. This is the start of fiat currency. This is the start of uh, being able to print paper money and not having a, uh, uh, a physical asset to, uh, to back up its value. And uh, the result of that is uh, what we have today. Today's dollars worth five cents of the 1913 dollar. So we have, uh, we have certainly devalued the dollar over the last, uh, little over a hundred years. And why is that happening? Well, it's happening because uh, this shows the total of money uh, held within the country. This is, this is how much money we've printed. And if you look what's happened here uh, since 2020, uh, we have actually printed more money uh, than we would printed in years in, in a single year. And this is the reason for our uh, uh, start to heavy inflation. Uh, you notice that you look from 2012 to 2020, uh, an eight year period, uh, the slope's fairly shallow. And uh, then in 2020, it just becomes uh, uh, a massive amount of printing. And we're not the only people this has happened to. Uh, if you look at uh, the mark in Germany a hundred years ago, uh, at, before their inflation really started, a uh, hundred years ago, they had uh, three dollar or three mark uh, bread, and uh, in twenty three, uh, things just went crazy, and a loaf of bread went to two million marks. It's also happened in recent history and close to home. In Mexico, in nineteen ninety four, uh, people went to bed uh, with a with fifty thousand pesos in the bank. Uh, they woke up the next morning and their 50,000 pesos had been devalued by 50%. They had the buying power of 25,000 pesos. Their, their money had been cut in half overnight. And uh, probably the most severe uh, uh, example in the world is the Zimbabwe dollar, the Z dollar. Uh, they have to print the largest bill in the world, $100 trillion dollars and that will barely buy a movie ticket. So that gives you an idea of how much they've had to devalue their money because of fiat currency. You know, gold and silver have been the secret of the wealthy for, well, for as long as there's been gold and silver used as a, as a currency, which is pretty much throughout all of known history. And uh, it protects you against uh, what happens with fiat currency because it's, it's a physical asset that has uh, actual value. And in fact, the central banks of many countries, such as Russia, China, India, Brazil, and Turkey, are uh, buying large amounts of uh, gold and silver because it's considered sound money. They're trying to protect themselves uh, from the coming crisis. Uh, and as inflation skyrocks, silver and gold protect your wealth because they go up with the inflation, unlike the uh, paper currency. And uh, so this is what we are. We're 7K metals, and here's what we do. We're a community of people on a mission to help each other create financial independence and preserve wealth using sound money. And uh, we've been doing that since 2016 with, an, uh, with a membership 
that specialize in saving money on precious metals, collectible coins. And we're going to get into that in a moment because that's a whole nother market. that's very interesting. Limited min minages, uh, very limited uh, production uh, coins. We do health insurance for our memberships, uh, for our membership, uh, travel, shopping, and uh, we do goods and services. Uh, they build two memberships to, uh, to meet more people's needs. The standard membership uh, uh, gets you access to the collector's uh, coins, uh, collectibles, collector's certification, uh, gets you access to our sound money wallet uh, where uh, you can uh, purchase uh, uh, bullion, uh, both gold and silver. It gives you a standard access to Stack and Sell, which is another company that we work with that uh, allows us to be able to uh, sell uh, collectible coins uh, uh, on the open market and also see what those coins are being valued at. Uh, access to coin drops, which those uh, uh, limited minage that we were mentioning just a moment ago, that's uh, what that is, that's dropping uh, coins into the market uh, that have been a limited uh, mint run. And it gives you three months of access to their uh, uh, wealth system uh, training. The premium membership does all of those things, but it also gives you premium stack and sell uh, 12 months to the wealth system app, uh, premium business reporting, which if you're gonna build the business side of this, that we're gonna talk about in a moment is, is uh, something you really need and then premium training, and it's only $4.99 uh, per year. So where do you start? Well, we can start by talking about bullion, which is the ability to just buy uh, gold and silver by weight. And uh, something that uh, this company does for you allows you to buy incrementally, which means that you don't have to buy full ounces and they don't make you buy, you know, 50 or 100 ounces of silver or maybe 10, 20 ounces of uh, gold to get the best price. And then here we'll talk about the uh, uh, art coins, the uh, limited edition collectibles. And I knew nothing about this seven months ago. I found it fascinating and have learned quite a bit in the last seven months. But uh, these coins have the added value of the fact that they're, uh, uh, they have artwork both built into them, it's minted in uh, through the striking process, and uh, these coins have value because they are both artistically pleasing and the fact that they're made from precious metals. And, you know, it's, I compare it to, to something like the Mona Lisa. That is not something that I probably would go out and buy even if I could uh, when it comes to what it is. But we all know that that's a piece of artwork with, with great value. And uh, if you could buy that and have it go up, that, uh, it would be a great investment and it obviously will, will, will go up over time. And a good example of that's this uh, Montana butterfly was uh, minted back in 2020 and the original price was $139. That current coin is currently selling for $500 to $1,000. And uh, from what I've seen, it'll probably run most days uh, closer to the thousand and quite frankly, hard to find, but uh, it, uh, it is available, but at a greatly inflated price just three years later. And if you look back up at the top of the Tiffany Art coin from back in 04, originally $90, and that coin's going for eight to $10,000 today. It shows you just what can happen uh, with a little time passing. 7K provides us training. Like I said, I knew nothing about uh, uh, art coins seven months ago, but uh, have learned quite a bit because 7K does provide us training both on the uh, uh, limited edition coins, the collectibles, and on uh, how to put, make your dollar go the furthest with, with bullion. And uh, the training is very, very uh, uh, thorough and get, get uh, a lot of information from that. And they do collector certification training. I had no idea what this uh, MS70 or on this coin, it says PF70 uh, meant, but that's a absolutely perfect coin. Uh, it's graded perfect by uh, NGC. 
uh, which is one of the two largest coin grading uh, companies in the nation, lets you know the uh, value of the coin because a perfectly graded coin is always going to uh, go up in value quicker than anything that has a flaw in it. And uh, the business side of this, you get to share and earn points and get paid. What that means is, is that uh, you can uh, join with the uh, membership and then your team will help you share this with other people. And over time, sharing this with other people starts to create a uh, income. And the first thing I saw was that if I uh, wanted to uh, collect, it would be a good thing to, uh, to build some team and end up with some extra uh, income to uh, uh, put into some savings in gold and silver. The standard membership, it generates 50 points and the premium membership generates uh, 150 points. So the modern collectible coins, they not only uh, uh, generate uh, uh, points, but they can actually generate points uh, every month. We'll cover that in a moment. But uh, generally speaking, they generate 15 to 20 points. And if you get on the monthly auto saver program, uh, they're going to uh, ship you a collectible coin every month. Uh, they do these gold unity notes. I've uh, uh, seen several of these. The artwork is absolutely gorgeous, but they're done on gold sheet that uh, uh, actually gives you some precious metal and the artwork. They do American Eagle state coins. They generate 15 points. And then they go to gold state animal coins at uh, 20 points. And all of these are uh, limited minage. Uh, they uh, don't just run these and run these. There's a, uh, there's a cutoff point where they'll never uh, be done again. And then the silver state animal does uh, 20 points. But uh, to get into uh, how they pay us uh, for building a, a membership, uh, you get a position when you join and uh, your team helps you invite a couple of people. You, we're going to nickname those uh, Bob and Sue tonight. And uh, you get uh, a person established on your left and a person established on your right. And as the team starts to grow, uh, just 100 members on your uh, uh, left doing uh, auto saver with a 20 point coin will generate uh, 20 points on uh, that team. And the same thing, you and Sue go to work and start to uh, build a team. And uh, same thing, well, that'll generate $2,000 a month in uh, additional income. So let's dive off into how that uh, team on each side gets built. Of course, everything good starts with you. And uh, you get Bob and Sue in, and that unlocks the first position, which is called associate. By just hosting two people, you become an associate and they will uh, pay you up to $500 a week for being an associate. And of course you have to have points on both sides uh, to, uh, to get that pay. So you go to work with uh, Bob and Sue and you've already got 150 points left, 150 points uh, right. If uh, they have done premium memberships and uh, we start helping Bob and Sue call some people they know and call some more people you know, and the next thing you know, here we are with 600 points left and 600 points right on Saturday evening. And uh, you have a, uh, a paycheck that week for $500. And that, that can go up by helping Bob and Sue. And you host another person personally on the uh, left and uh, get a couple more people under them. Uh, do the same thing on the right and get them a couple of people. And now your two uh, people have become associate. And by having two associates uh, under you, one left, one right, you're now copper and your monthly uh, or your weekly, excuse me, uh, pay goes to uh, as much as a thousand dollars a week is where you top out. But you again, have to put points in for the uh, paycheck. And then you do that again, uh, you get uh, two associates in again and host three. You now hosted uh, three left, three right, and uh, you go bronze. Uh, by uh, getting those in, you get a team to copper and a team to uh, copper, and there's bronze. And uh, your pay can go as much as $2,000 a week. 
uh, just based on uh, doing a couple of thousand points a week in each side of your team and uh, teams starting to grow. We're not going to go through all of the ranks tonight, but we've covered associate, which is 500, copper 1,000, bronze 2,000, and then uh, we'll talk about silver for just a moment. And uh, you do silver uh, by putting a couple more people in uh, yourself on each side and helping a couple of your team members, one left and right, go bronze. And if you do that in 90 days, uh, here's what happens. The company, if you do that in the first 90 days, will actually give you 100 ounces of silver. And uh, uh, we've had team members win that. Uh, it is doable. Uh, and that's a pretty nice bonus because we're talking about a uh, silver bar that's worth between $3,000, $3,500 in today's market. Uh, and that's a pretty nice bonus for your first 90 days worth of work. So that's, uh, that's how the company works, uh, both on the collectible side and the business building side. Before we go, uh, I'd like to uh, have uh, one more person share a little bit about what uh, this is uh, doing for them. Uh, Tim Bumpus, uh, are you... Uh, uh, out there and uh, able to uh, get in real quick. Sure, Howard, I'm here and I, and uh, thanks for the presentation. It certainly makes a lot of sense. You know, I was looking at, uh, I've got several of those collectible coins now for the time we've been in there. We're on that uh, auto saver, so they've been building up. But while you were talking about that uh, Montana butterfly coin that was, what was it, a 139 when it was new? I looked out there on Stack and Sell, which is very, very handy to be able to see what how you can buy one, what they're worth, what they're selling for. Well, there's four of them out there for sale, anywhere from $1,489 to $1,699. So when we talk about that $500 to $1,000, you can't buy one for that right now. So it's pretty amazing. In fact, I looked at just one of them that I had bought, and it's a five-ounce coin, so it's a big coin. Um, it's a, it's worth over $1,000 more than I paid for it, and that's, well, that's what they're selling them for. So Pretty exciting stuff. You know, I look at it like a monthly deal, like putting money in a 401k, but uh, anybody on here tell me their 401k is doing better than that. I, that'd be hard to believe. I mean, it's just, you've got your, got your money in a solid asset instead of dollars, which is, we know is losing, losing power. So, you know, it's, it's exciting to know that you got an asset like that and you let your friends and family know about it and they'll pay you a decent amount of money. In fact, they'll pay you as much as, uh, as you want to make when you see those different levels at 3,500. And I know those levels keep going from there. So exciting stuff, Howard. And uh, i tell you, we're pumped up about it and see it being extremely strong in, our, in the near future. So with that, I'm going to kick it back to you. I appreciate it. Tim, thank you for the uh, uh, testimony, the information. Uh, amazing that that coin's still going up like that. Well, with that, we'll finish the uh, presentation. And if uh, everybody will just unmute, say hey real quick. Uh, we'll be back to do this again on uh, Thursday night at uh, 7.30 Central. Thank All right, you. Howard, awesome presentation. Thank you. Harris, thank you for taking the time to share your story. And of course, Tim uh, Bumpus, uh, Mary in the background helping. Thank you for everything that you do uh, to help these leaders and these new folks coming on all over the world. And uh, it's awesome. I appreciate it. So guys, what's going to happen next is the person who invited you is going to give you a, a call or, you know, take their call. Don't make it weird. If it's not for you, it's okay. Uh, but if it is, understand there's a lot of people that are here to help you. So uh, I'm going to unmute everybody and uh, guys have a, a blessed evening and we'll see you Thursday night. All right. Good night, everybody. Good night. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Kim. Thanks, Al. Good night, guys. Good night.